like a World Cup competition or the Olympics for our sport. The work never stops for a horse trainer, especially during the week of the world's most prestigious horse show. This is the cream of the crop. We have horses from all over the country and all over the world, really, um, and it is the best of the best. Renee Philpott is the assistant trainer at Zubrod Stables and Prospect. She has eight kids performing at Freedom Hall this week. We do our homework all summer. We do our homework all winter, and then when we get to a horse show, it's time to shine. Riders and horses are groomed to the nines when in the arena, but outside in the barn, it's all hot, hard work. Our employees that work for us actually set up a room and they live here for the week. Phil Potts says having the top horse show in their backyard is a privilege. A lot of people that come in from out of town, they don't have the opportunity to bring their aunts and uncles and grandparents here to watch them perform. For most riders and trainers, this sport is a lifestyle. They grew up loving a horse or they're the horse crazy little girl and they just have always had that notion in their mind that they're going to be a horsewoman or horseman. And being able to perform on the green shavings, Phil Potts says, is a moment her riders will never forget. It's very special to me this week because we do have four riders that have never shown here before and just being able to help them fulfill a dream. Alex Durham, WLKY News.